We're in the place they call the Air Canada Center in Toronto, nice Ontario, game, huh? the home of the Raptors, where we're broadcasting live. Welcome, everybody. Glad you decided to spend your Thursday night with us here at 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan. Joining me, Clark Kellogg, Greg Anthony, and courtside, Doris Burke. Now let's take a look at the Bulls' opening lineup. And small and power forward, it's Dunleavy and Gasol. Rose is the one with Butler as the two. And it's Noah in at the center, locking down the middle. Really well done there. Just confident and composed, never in a hurry. Here's Lowry. Pass to DeRozan. Rebound by Rose. Chicago with the ball. And it's been a close. <laughs> Up to this point, a closely contested game as we start the second quarter. And before we move on, what do you guys think about what we've seen so far from the Bulls? It's all about their defense. They have just done a terrific job of negating the timing and spacing of their opponent. Every shot is challenged and challenged well. In a moment now to reset the lineups courtesy of Gatorade all fueled up for the second quarter of basketball. So for Chicago right now Gibson is the four with Gasol at the five. Brooks out there with Jimmy Buck and it's Miritich in at the three slot. They get it back. Gasol. Nice work on the board. He's paying off with the basket. Gasol's got the opening basket here in the second quarter for the Bulls. Bulls on D. Four point game. and a screen on Miritich and DeRozan. Here we go. The pick gave him all the room he needed and he knocks down the J. A lot of space right there to get that shot off. Not a very good job with the defender getting over the top of that screen in that particular play. Brooks kicks the up. And that one hits back iron. I didn't see that. And the first half. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Well, two quarters down, two to go. Welcome back. It was a closely contested first quarter for Chicago. And that'll do it for now as the second half of our game is... Here we go now, the start of the third quarter, welcoming you back in a closely contested first half so far. The star pair of Lowry and DeRozan are the guards. Jonas Valanciunas is out there with Skull, and it's Carroll in at the three spot. That's the five out there for the Raptors. Here's Skola. Chicago grabs the miss. Oh, excellent interior D to force the miss. His defensive ability is a big factor. I mean, there's no denying that. That is his shot, guys. So you can't just give it to him. You've got to get up on him and get into his airspace there. Lowry well, passes to DeRozan. Here's Valanciunas. That is good. <laughs> 24 seconds left to play in the third. Rose against Lowry. Rose dishes to Butler. 11 seconds left to play in the third. Noah, and there's the whistle. Fouled hard on the shot. He'll go to the line. It's on Jonas Valanciunas. And really the defense fouling there to protect the layup, but that's exactly what you need to do. It is. I mean, no reason to back off and give him the layup. You're much better off making him go to the line. Now we're with the ball. With one on the clock. He got it up in time. Okay, ready. Put your hands together. We welcome you back to what has been a good one here as we get into the fourth quarter. Here's Chicago. Three-point lead on the court for the Bulls, getting this fourth quarter started. The big man are Gibson and Noah. Reinhardt is out there with Brooks, and it's Miritich in at the three. Now, here is Miritich. 
Here's Gibson. It falls. Oh. Toronto calls timeout. They're down by five. 41 seconds left in the fourth quarter. I want to in with Doris Burke. Doris? Yes, Kevin. Dwayne Casey was just going over the plan with his team. He laid out the X's and O's and told them, we're still alive, guys. We've just got to work together, trust each other, and play our backsides off. Kevin, we'll see if they've got enough to get over the time. Thank you, Doris. Luis Scola, he's checked in for Toronto. DeRozan comes in for Terrence Ross. I think we'll see them burn the clock a bit here. You know, I think that's probably a smart move. I think so, too. And stolen by Carroll. And here's the fast break. Carroll leading the way. That doesn't go on the chance to tie. And they commit an intentional foul. It's another one of those so they can get into the penalty. Honestly, just doing what they have to in order to get the basketball back. That's a good foul, though. I like that. I mean, clock management crucial at this time of the game. It's the first, and that makes it a three-point lead. So he gets them both, and it's a four-point ballgame. And thanks to his good work at the line there, now we have a two-possession ballgame. And the Raptors call time here. They're behind by four. 19 seconds left in the fourth. DeRozan against Butler. Offensive rebound. And now an intentional foul. They need the ball back as soon as possible. It's the first, and that puts them up by five. And a tough break is his second attempt at the line. No good. And the Raptors call time here. They're trailing by five. 11 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Okay, Put your hands together for 11 seconds left in the game. And Valanciunas kicks to Scola. Valanciunas passes to Scola. A shot by Lowry. Wide open. Three pointers off the mark. And so it's Chicago winning this one. A narrow win under difficult circumstances, Greg. Is